It's time to see what's cooking with Tom's Take on Takeout. Welcome to Tom's Take on Takeout out here at Frank's Press Box on the west side. My top tier co-host, Gary Snellenberger and Ted Terzian join fellowship out here at Frank's Press Box again. Gary, you're an expert on restaurants. Everybody comes up to me, how does Gary know so much? How does he know about all these menus? He rattles that stuff off like he owns the place. How's that come about, Snelly? Size is the prize, <laughs> you know? So this is a great place. Yeah, tell us what you know about Frank's Press Box. Uh, I know Frank's been here for a long time. I think you said close to 30 years, if not just over. The pizza is the bomb, and the special on Sunday, buy one, get one half off, I believe. <laughs> Ice cold beer. Great camaraderie. Cold great, beer great here. Patio. Yeah, yeah. Well, the, the, at, you know, as we talked about earlier, the Jim Ahern retirement event out here was just, uh, that's a perfect venue out here on the West Saginaw. Speaking of the West Side, Ted Terzian, Mr. West Side himself, he thinks the West Side is the best side. Absolutely. Gary and I disagree with him wholeheartedly, but... This is on the west side, and this is where you come. You just ordered some food for your lovely wife, Beth. And what is it about Frank's? Besides its convenience for you, Mr. West Sider, that well, brings you here. Not only that, this is this is the hangout for the West Siders. You know, we come here after the games, uh, Lansing Catholic, uh, a lot of the games here. We come back, but I'll tell you, we've been doing a lot of stuff for you know, uh, talking about family run. We nice. have, and that, and you, yeah, you and Gary are big sticklers on that. Let's stick, you know, let's stick uh, yeah. locally owned. But I'll tell you what, this is the ultimate family run organization. Yeah. You know, been here for a long time, and you know, the the, the fate of boys is not. So, a great so the job. fate of family knows something about food preparation. Just a little bit, just a little <laughs> bit. They know how to make pizza too. And his, um, and the son, uh, now Frank, young Frank here is. is uh, Doing a wonderful job here. They have a Detroit style pizza. I can't wait to try it. Yeah. That's what I just ordered. Detroit style. What is Detroit, Detroit style? style? Well, it's thicker in the pan. Thicker? Yeah. Gotcha. Snell, your go to when you come to Frank's Press Box. Oh, pizza. You know, they just started the pan or the Detroit style, as uh, Frank said and Ted ordered, but. Uh, I like the big one, ham, pepperoni, and mushrooms, my style. <laughs> good sauce, very good sauce. That makes a difference. And we're here with Frank Feta Jr., one of the long family members of Frank's Press Box. You guys, have been, your family's been in the business so long. How many people have been involved in the restaurant business? Any idea, Frank, the number of all you people involved, the Fetas? Well, it started with a distributing warehouse, Paul Feta and Sons, with my grandpa, his two brothers, Ernie and Larry. Okay. And then they had an accident there, the place burned down, and my grandpa bought this and ran it with his three sons, Dave, Phil, and Jerry. Gotcha. And they've been running it for 30 years, 32 years. I've worked here off and on for the past 15. Right. Went away to culinary school, moved to Chicago, and then I find myself right back here always. Right back so, here, but you got that yeah. experience exterior and brought it back. Yeah. Probably a good thing. Yeah, right. it's good to get a different perspective. Right. Going to different restaurants, seeing how they operate and how they run their show and then you just had a you just had a big event here the retirement of Jim Ahern, Lansing Catholic football coach and a big crowd here. Big Catholic crowd coming over here on the west side and, and you just bring them in from all over the place. A lot of people that return. Why do they come, Frank, to Frank's press box? What draws them here in your opinion? Well the Lansing Catholic football crowd actually started back when I played football. From 2004 to 2006. You were a young pup, man. Yeah, that was, that was a lifetime ago, it seems like. But well, for after, you, maybe. Yeah. For football, after football games on Friday nights, all the parents and players and kids would come up here for pizza and beverages and that kind of stuff. And it's still, to this day, every Friday after football games, the Lansing Catholic crowd comes in here. Oh, so it wow. only seemed fitting to have Jim Ahern's retirement party here, I guess. Absolutely. So. Absolutely. So, what, are there particular go-tos that your preferred customers, like say a Jim Baker who's come here 
a couple of times, maybe. Uh, the current head football coach of Lansing Catholic. Are, are there certain on you know dishes that people? Oh, I gotta go. I gotta go to Frank's for such and such. Now, if I had to say anything, it'd be the pizza. We make the dough from scratch every day. Make the sauce from scratch. Toppings are fresh, caught every day. I mean, really good. I mean, meats that we use for the pizza. Good cheese. It's actually still our family cheese. It's got our name on it. Fate is best. So nice. Yeah. So we still get that, and yeah, it's just homemade and always good. So. So can you imagine, Frank Fate Jr. What? football season is going to be like we're all getting back to some level of normalcy in a college football afternoon here or after the high school games so that we talked about what this place is going to be like you got to be really jacked about oh, that i'm excited to just have people back in here you know finally yeah. get back to normal july 1st i believe so i mean we're getting some kind of normalcy now with the nomad the mask right. being lifted and all that stuff so i'm just excited to get the place full again and get people uh having a good time okay address location uh, hours for our consumers out there frank's press box here on tom's take on takeout with gary snellberger and ted terzian uh we're located at 7216 west saginaw highway in lansing michigan hours are 11 a.m every day till 11 at night and once the curfew mandate's lifted we're going to be open till midnight every night oh terrific you're looking forward to that thanks so much for having us out here frank thanks